Dave Grohl told the crowd that they'd see a revolving door of drummers honoring Hawkins. When it comes to Taylor Hawkins, you gotta celebrate the drummers, right? Taylor Hawkins of Foo Fighters performs on stage at the after party for the Los Angeles premiere of Studio 666 at the Fonda Theater on February 16, 2022 in Hollywood, California. Rich Fury slash Getty Images The All-Star Taylor Hawkins tribute concert went on for more than five hours Saturday, September 3rd closing the night out with an emotional, enthralling Foo Fighters set at London's Wembley Stadium. The show was a special tribute to the late drummer, with an impressive number of special guests throughout the evening. The Foo Fighters headlining moment featured many of the band's greatest hits, assisted by friends and family on the drums in Taylor Hawkins' place. Explore see latest videos, charts and news See latest videos, charts and news Dave Grohl told the crowd that they'd see a revolving door of drummers honoring Hawkins on stage with them and noted, to cheers all around, when it comes to Taylor Hawkins, you gotta celebrate the drummers, right? Josh Father This fine young drummer challenged me to a drum battle, at first I thought she was kidding. She was not, he said. I engaged in a drum battle and she proceeded to kick my A in front of the entire F, ing world. Rufus Taylor took the drums for these days and best of you. Grohl said, we've known him since he was a little kid because his father's band, Queen, is Taylor's favorite band, and his father was IT. Darling, trading off vocals on the verses, before McCartney segued into Helter Skelter. McCartney revealed he'd never done O, 